Hey guys, it's Carolina here from Carolina's Crafts and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have an unboxing video to show you guys. And this is actually part of the Secret Cupid YouTube hop. So um, this was hosted by Rachel, who is Paper Ventures on YouTube. And the person that sent to me is Crystal, who is June Chris, I believe 315. I will have her information linked down below. But every day we are posting an unboxing video of what we received from our person that sent to us. So it was like a hop, um, but it was also like a secret Cupid because I didn't know who was gonna send to me and I sent to somebody else. So the person that sent to me, I didn't send back to them. I sent to somebody else. So it kind of just went around. So you guys could check out down below in the description box, all the ladies who participated and each day who is posting their video and I hope it gives you inspiration on tons and tons of Valentine's Day ideas and things that you could create. So let's go ahead and open up this package from Crystal and I was going to be posting um, first um, originally but we had to change up the days. Gosh guys this box is so big and it's not a Cricut it's just in this kind of box but Wow, this box is humongous. I don't even know which side to open this. If I'm being honest, because this box is so big, it's kind of been intimidating for me to open this up. I was just like, oh my gosh, where am I gonna put everything? All right, let's see. Hopefully I opened it the right way and it looks like I did. Sorry guys, I'm hitting the camera. Let me just read this. I don't know if this is part of her day one or not. So let me go ahead and read this. Look at the card. It's so pretty. Okay, so she is JRS Wifey. Um, I think that's a 714 on Instagram and June Chris 315 on YouTube. So I'm gonna have um, all the ladies linked down below so you guys know she'll be linked as well. Oh my goodness, so much stuff in here. This box is jam-packed, guys. Okay, I'm just gonna take things out. Okay, this one doesn't look like it's labeled, but some of them look like they are. So here is 13, 14. All right, I'm gonna try to just open them as I go. I'm guessing this is number one and then this is number two. Let me put everything else aside though so we can open them in order. Okay, so I have days one, two, and three here. This is two, this is three. I think this is one. Um, this is the only one that I didn't see a number on. So I'm guessing this is one. So let's open this up. Oh my goodness. I had no idea what this was just looking at it from the bubble wrap, but this is so cute. Guys, this is a heart hot air balloon. How adorable is this? Oh my goodness, Crystal. You're going to have to tell me if this is a cutting file or what. And she used, I think this this is all heart. Is this all heart? Maybe. I know this is all heart. I don't know. I don't really have the collection. So, oh my goodness, how cute. And she included some chocolate in here. Girl, this is so beautiful. Thank you so much. Look at these little tool bows. Oh, this trim. Oh my goodness, this is so pretty. I love this. It looks like a cut file because I see like the perforated lines. But oh my goodness, how beautiful. Thank you so much, Crystal. So that was day one, guys. Here is day two. She has this embellishment here, which I could probably take off and reuse. Super cute embellishment and it's wrapped in like this pretty wrapping paper. It's like textured and all. And she's even got this, um, um, this tool that everyone's been getting from Dollar Tree lately. Okay, so let's see, this is day two. This looks like uh, one of those suitcase things. Oh, it's not, wait. Is it? No, wait, what is this? I've never even seen this before. Oh my goodness. What is this? Oh my God, and she added tissue paper so that this doesn't get ruined. Look how cute. I don't even know how to open this up. Wait, is it Velcro? Oh my gosh, look at this guys. And look at all that stitching she did all around. This is, I think, all heart too. 
And they these beautiful little beads that she has here that are wire wrapped. Oh my God, look at all the stitching all around. Oh my goodness, even the back, even the bottom. Oh my gosh. So inside of here, she's got, this is so cute. Um, I'm going to need a link to a video tutorial on this if there is one. Oh my God, look how cute this is. So in here, she's got this cute memory dex card that's in the shape of a heart box. Oh my gosh, this has girl power. She did so much stitching all around here. Oh my gosh, Crystal. Everything is so beautiful. And here, and here she's got these erasers from the Target Dollar Spot. Thank you so much. I've seen people be making those into like charms and things. So those are super adorable and super cute. Oh, and she actually included her um, sticker on here. I'm trying to get them back in here. There we go. So there's the memory dex card. This is so cute. I love the way that this is packaged up, girl. So cute. Oh, are these all memory dex cards? And here she's got this memory dex card. She did like a vellum, or not vellum, like an acetate shaker. And that's like the mylar paper. It's a cute little shaker. And I see like she did some like crinkly or not crinkly, but like um like a rosette kind of style just to add some dimension. Um, she's got another uh, little roller skate here. It says obsessed XOXO. How cute. Very, very pretty crystal. And then here is her third memory dex card. Oh, she die cut like a rosette here and made it into a heart. I love how that looks says you are gold. You've got this cute little record here. Some flower embellishments. Look at all that stitching. Your stitching is perfect. Oh my goodness. Look at all that perfect stitching. And she used vellum here, a heart um, foiled vellum. Oh my gosh. So pretty. Thank you so much, Crystal. I really need to know like where you got this idea from to make this. This is so stinking cute. I absolutely love it. Cute little like 3D thing. Oh my gosh, how adorable. Thank you so much, girl. And then here is her number three. Definitely going to keep that bag and reuse that. What is this? Oh my goodness. So here she's got like this, um, I forgot what these are called. Like the, what is it? Like a cracker box or something? Oh my goodness, look how adorable. All your packaging is so cute for everything. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, are those beads? How do I even get this out? Do I have to open up both sides? I might have to. Hold on guys, gotta use some scissors to push this out. All right, there we go. So here she's got this. So this is her sequin mixes. Look at this first pretty one with some pink hearts I see, and this is all shades of pink. There's some little like flowery sequins in there. Oh my gosh, so pretty. I love sequin mixes, guys, especially when they're pink and they've got hearts. So pretty. And this is her second one. Oh, she's got these hearts. I don't even know where those are from. Looks like different kinds of hearts. Some are filled in, some are hollow, um, like some are, um, the circles are inside to taken out. There's some ellipse in here. Oh, how pretty. Thank you, Crystal. Here's the next one. Ooh, this one's got little loved ones in here. Oh my gosh, look how pretty that is. And there's some hearts in there. Oh, this is so pretty. And there's some minty colors and like a matte pink. How pretty. I oh, would definitely be using those sequin mixes for sure. And then she's got some beads. Oh my gosh, thank you. I've been needing some like pink little striped beads and things that I could wire wrap. And there's some, what is that, a heart in there, I think. Oh, thank you so much. Oh my gosh, I don't have any of those. Thank you, thank you. Okay, and in the last one, she's got these beads. Oh my goodness. And look at those little heart ones down there. Oh my gosh, I am going to go to town wire wrapping those. Thank you so much, Crystal. So generous of you to share all these goodies with me. And we're only on day three, guys. Oh my goodness. How pretty. 
I probably should have taken a picture before I started opening all these things. Here is day four. She's got this cute little baggie with this embellishment on here. Look, or that's like a tag, actually. I could reuse this. Oh, this is some sturdy tag. That's layered like a bajillion times. How pretty. So, wait, how do I even open this? Wait, this is like a box bag? Oh, this is an interesting bag. I've never even seen one like that before. Oh my gosh, what is this? Oh, there's a bunch of stuff in here. Oh my goodness. Okay, so inside of here, oh my gosh, what is this? There's so, oh my goodness. This is the cutest little tea holder ever. <gasps> Look guys, she stitched all around this. Oh my goodness. And you could refill it with tea and you could just grab the tea from down here. Oh my gosh, Crystal. This is so beautiful. Oh my goodness. Look at all that stitching on every single little teeny piece. Oh my gosh. And I could just grab myself a little tea bag. Oh, thank you so much. Oh my gosh. That is beautiful. I need to get myself some more um, 3D file projects. You made so many 3D things. Oh my gosh. This is... I, I love that so much. Oh my goodness. Thank you, thank you, Crystal. I got so many ideas just from this alone and there's so much inspiration from all the videos and all the girls have so many cool things they've been sharing that they've received. Oh my gosh, so much inspiration all around and I'm getting so much more just from all the stuff that you sent me, Crystal. And this feels like a mug. Oh my goodness. <gasps> oh my. Look, Kai, she sent me a mug. And it says love on the inside. Oh my gosh, how cute. Thank you so much, girl. Oh my gosh, I love my mugs. You guys know that. Oh my goodness. Thank you, thank you so much. Everything is so pretty so far. And look how it all goes together. I love it. Okay, guys, let me find day five and six and seven, and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm thinking that this was day five and six because it only says day four on here. Uh, or, so sorry, day five, but I think it might have been day four and five. I don't see a day five on here, but I don't see a day five. So I'm thinking this was um, four and five. So we're going to go with that because I don't see a day five. But here is day six. So here we go. I love this tool that she's been using. I picked some up from Dollar Tree too, but I don't have all the colors that she has that she's been using in here. But it's such a good use of your tool, girl. So this is what she has here and I could take this off so it's only on one little thing. Nice pretty rosette. So I took the other one off too. Actually, now that I'm looking at it, how am I gonna reuse this? If this has day two, oh, this comes off I think. I don't think she glued those on. Oh, good. I could reuse them. How cute. So there was that. And inside of this one, I love this um, like foil tissue wrapping paper thing. Sorry for all the crinkly guys. Is this your tag flip? Oh my goodness. Oh, look how pretty. I'm going to save this bag too because... That's totally reusable. Oh my goodness, girl. You're just blowing me away with everything you sent me in the swap. Oh my goodness. So there's like this chunky charm here. Oh my goodness, look at all this goodness. Oh, look at this. Oh, and this pom-pom. Oh my gosh. And she has two um, little, uh, what are these called? Binder rings. Guys, look at this. So this is her first tag that she attached on here. She made a cute little heart, a shaker heart with pink vellum. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's so beautiful. Then she's got this tag right here that says looking good. Look at all this wire wrapping and all these beads she has all the layering, the rosettes, all that stitching. Oh, I love how you went from zigzag to straight. Oh, I love that. I've never actually done that. I try to go zigzag all the way around, but I love that. I love how that looks. These beautiful um, glitter jemmies. 
Then this is her next one right here. What? There's like little die cuts in here. Oh, how adorable is that? There's little die cuts in here. Oh, that is so cute. Is this a die for that background piece or something? Oh my God, how adorable is that? Thank you. And I get to use these little ephemera pieces now. Oh, how cute. Then the next one, she's got, is this like a bag topper? So I think I could use this as a bag topper, but she added some um, of these butterfly embellishments on here. And there's three layers, look how cute. So there's like a pattern paper layer, then the mylar, and then like this um, detailed layer and she stitched on them. Oh, how cute. And I think if I take this off, I could even use that as a bag topper, but I'm probably not gonna take it apart. And I'm probably just gonna use this as inspiration and have it just hanging in my wall. Oh my gosh, how cute. And here, here's a little square one that she attached, um, made these little like clip things and put some um, eyelets in there. Oh my goodness, I'm loving this. And this is a shaker. It's a mylar acetate. Girl, all that stitching. Everything is so beautiful. She's got another one of those like heart kind of tag things and here she's got some bows. Look at this. Oh, look at that pretty one. I think this might be um, um, like a ribbon material thing from Hobby Lobby, but I'm not entirely sure. Oh my gosh, look at these pretty bows. How pretty. And then here, this is like a stand. Oh, it stands up. This is like a little stand for this tag flip. Oh my goodness. Look, so it'll stand up on its own just like that. Oh my gosh. Wow, girl. Wow, wow, wow. I am blown away with all this creativity. I'm going to lay it down so you guys could see it, but oh my goodness. Wow. Okay, guys, here is day seven. We're like halfway done through this. I'm going to untie this. This is some like fluffy, nice soft yarn okay slide it off is the answer i need a dye like this i need this love dye if that's a dye i think it's a dye oh my gosh but i need this dye that is so cute totally gonna take that off and reuse that so here is day seven guys and we open this inside of here she's got this thing I think this is from Dollar Tree and it's just housing some goodies in here, which I don't know what's in here yet, but we're about to find out. I see some shred. Oh my goodness, it's can't. Oh my gosh. Strawberry cream, white fudge, chocolate. Oh my goodness, thank you. I do love me some chocolate and I actually love strawberry flavored and I love white chocolate. And then she also sent me some gummies. Oh my goodness, thank you so much. Oh my, thank you, thank you, thank you, girl. Always need some sweets. I'm just gonna put the shredded back in here. Always need some sweet treats, thank you. All right, guys, I had to clear off my desk a little bit to make space for some more things, but I'm back with number eight. So here it says eight with this cute little tag that says you and me, and it's a cute little like envelope embellishment. Girl, I love how you made little embellishments for all of these. Um, like we made like a little tag for all of them. They're all so cute and I have tool guys for days so I'm keeping all of these little pieces. Oh my gosh. I got tool for days I better start adding more tool and stuff to my projects So for day eight we have this cute little box She added this rosette that she die cut and made the little hearts on the outside and this beautiful flower Look how layered that is and chunky and dimensional. This might be from um, Lori who makes them, but I don't know. Maybe maybe um, Crystal made it. I have no idea. I just see Lori make them all the time. So I'm going to open this. And inside of here, are these more charms? Oh my God, it's a chunky charm. Look how gorgeous this is. Oh, I'm so going to use this for inspiration because I don't know how to make these. Oh my gosh, how beautiful. Look at this, guys. Oh, look at that little lip thing. Oh, my goodness. Look how beautiful this is. Oh, my gosh. I want to add this to my keychain. I want to use it for inspiration, but I also just want to add it to my keychain. Oh, my gosh. And she even made this tassel one. 
Oh my gosh, look how cute. But guys, I am obsessed. Oh my goodness, look at these hearts on here. So she has like these, what, I forgot what these are called, bezel things, but you could attach resin pieces um, to make it like a little charm using those little things. So she did that on there, she did it on this heart, she did it on the lip, she did it on this candy. Oh my God, look at this chunky goodness. Oh my goodness, and all these different like tassels or, or little like um, ribbons and trims. Oh my god, so cute. Thank you, Crystal. I want to like add it to my keychain, but I don't because I want it in my craft room and I want to use it as inspiration to inspire me to make my own so I could like look at this and see how to make one. Oh, that is so cute. Thank you, Crystal. Okay, day nine, we got right here feels round I don't know what this is but here's day nine she's got this tag and this embellishment cluster and again I could just take off the numbers and then I could reuse this embellishment so she only stuck it on like with one thing so thank you so much for all of these goodies and embellishments and everything I even love this little ribbon I don't have that many options for ribbon like girl you have so many ribbon like even just this look at all these little ribbons she had so many options I don't have all those options so I'm just going to keep them all, and now I'll have options. Oh my goodness, look at this! She's got this, like, bucket. So she created this bucket with this beautiful bow. Look at that, guys. Or, I mean, I think, this, I think these buckets are Dollar Tree, but I'm not entirely sure, so I don't know. But she's got this bow she made, and inside of here is our self-care goodies. So what is this? Oh my gosh! A cupcake hand sanitizer cake or case look how cute this is oh my goodness thank you so much and she's got a hand sanitizer in here what scent is this um it is sparkling cranberry you guys know we all need our hand sanitizer right now so thank you so much oh my gosh and i love cupcakes and then she's also got these socks oh my gosh thank you Look how cute these are, cozy Valentine's Day socks. Oh, they're so cute. And they're the pink, and they're like pink. And she even made a, um, a cute little topper for this. Oh my goodness. It says cozy wishes. How adorable. And she stitched on it and everything. Oh my gosh. You went to town literally decorating everything. And these are so soft. I love them. Thank you so much. And just look, at, look how cute this is. I could reuse this now. Perfect packaging, ready to go. Oh, there's even a wire wrapped or um, a bead on here. Look at all that way of using up some yarn. How adorable. Thank you so much. Then I have number 10 right here for you guys. So she's got more of this yarn that she used here. She's got this cute embellishment that I'm just going to take off to show you guys. Look at that. It says, I like you lots. Look at that cute little doggy. Oh my goodness, how adorable. So I'm just putting all my embellishments aside so I could reuse them. Because she didn't glue down the numbers, so I could just easily um, reuse the embellishments. Here's all that yarn I could use on a project. I still have the one from the other batch too, from the other thing that she had. So much cuteness and so many things I could just reuse. Thank you so much. And this is so big, I have no idea what this is. But this is day 10. I'm going to save this and cut this up. And this would look super cute in a junk journal. Wouldn't that look so cute, guys? Just like some wrapping paper, but in a junk journal. And like with this texture, especially. Or even as a pocket on something. Oh, it's going to be so cute. What is this? I see like a tote bag. Oh, I'd rather be watching homework movies. Oh my gosh. Did you make this? This is so cute. That is so true. Oh my goodness. And she's got this bow here that's a clip. So you could put this in a, in your hair. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Look at all these goodies she sent me. Girl, you spoiled me. <laughs> oh my god. This is so funny. So I have um, three packs of the Lucky Us. I just recently used one. I still have two more. Thank you so much. Oh my goodness, I don't have the 12 by 12 though, so thank you so much for sharing. 
Oh, I needed some of this when I was making some projects. So I'm going to have to make another album. Or maybe we'll make like a folio or something using the 6x8. I'm going to have to see what I have to do with it. But oh my gosh. And she even sent me some washi tape from the Lucky Us collection. She sent me some ephemera. And then she even sent me the thickers. Oh wait, there's two thickers. Oh, it's thickers and the cardstock stickers. Thank you so much. Oh, thank you so much for sharing. This is such a cute collection. I actually struggled with uh, crafting with it at first because it's very colorful, but then I love how everything turned out. So I'm going to have to make another album, but I'm thinking maybe I'll make a folio instead of an album and we'll use up the six by eight paper pad. Oh my gosh, it's going to be so cute. I can't wait to see what I come up with for that, but I'm going to have to use it for sure. Then we have number 11 right here. And again, more of that tool. I'm going to have so much to use. Actually, this one I'm going to slide off because it's such a cute bow. I don't think I'll be able to recreate this bow though. So well, I'm just going to slide this one off. Hopefully I'm not killing anything underneath. All right, so look at this cute little embellishment she has here. And it says, you are so sweet. And she stitched on it. She made a cute little heart shaker. Oh my god, this is so cute. I love this bow you have here. Even like the doily background is so cute. Oh, I love all your embellishments. Thank you so much for sharing and creating all this goodness for me. I love everything. You have literally blown me away so far with everything. And like, I would have been happy with just that. You could have split up some of these to make them into 14 days. Oh my gosh, you made one of these! Oh, these are so cute. So this is her rosettes. Oh my God, look at them. They're hearts. How adorable. So she made one of these pouches. That's like a shaker pouch. Oh my gosh, look how cute. And she stitched on it and everything. She's even got this like crinkly effect with stitching on here. She's got this heart rosette on here to decorate. And it's on a Velcro closure. And you open this up and you got this, which is all on acetate, her embellishments. I think something was supposed to go here. Something go there. Hold on. Something fell off, guys, I think. Oh, wait, this. This right here. Hold on. So this heart, it just needs to be glued on to that because she stuck that down. All right. So I'm going to have to do that. Look how cute these uh, rosettes are, though. Look how cute. All the layering. Look at this little coffee one. So I'm seeing that she has the digital collection of All Heart, which maybe that's what I need to do. I just need to get the digital so I can still craft with like the All Heart collection because this actually looks really good. I don't know if everything was digital, including the paper, but everything looks so good. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Look how pretty everything is. The holographic. Oh my goodness. It says hugs and kisses. I love you. Girl power. Again, I just have to stick that down. Happy. Be kind. And this is a little mixtape embellishment. Oh my god, these are so cute. And again, look at this pouch, guys. All, all these sequins in here. So she created the sequin mix. Put that in there. I need to get like... Is this like the clear... Um, the full size sheets that people use sometimes? Is that what this is? Because my acetate is super... Um, it's like very, very sturdy. So I don't think I'd be able to make this with my acetate, but this way you, your sequins could still move around in here. I'm gonna have to make one of these pouches. Somebody else sent me one of those pouches that they made in a swap and I just love it so much that I just need to make one. Okay, here is day 12. Again, I don't know why I keep untying these things. I'm never gonna be able to recreate it when I could just pull off the um the ribbon but oh well we already untied it so or kind of untied it now there's a knot oh my gosh I should have just pulled it off in the first place okay so this is day 12 another embellishment I get to reuse so again I could take it off she just put like little glue dots on there so I get to reuse all of these embellishments and all these goodies okay so in here she has oh my goodness I don't even know what this is, but I love the pink Mylar already. Look how cute this is. This, oh my God, it's a little envelope. You made this? <gasps> I need a tutorial on this envelope. Oh my gosh, and she's got the cute little snap closure. Oh my goodness, I need a tutorial. I hope you have one on your channel. I'm gonna have to watch, or I hope you're posting one soon. 
Um, so she's got this beautiful cherry resin piece that she stuck on here. That's a little charm. She, I can't believe she made this. Oh my God, it's so cute. And she's got some embellishments in here. And she stuck them on some acetate. Okay, let me just take them out. So here, oh look, she's got this one that she stitched on. She's did that wa uh, that wrapping with like a sequin thing and it says yay for today. And she did some layering. This is also a shaker. I love the stitching. I need to start stitching with something other than gold because I just use gold for everything. But I really need to start stitching with another color. <laughs> here she's got these, oh my God, look at these. She's made like these puffy, or not puffy hearts, but they're like mylar acetate hearts. They're shakers, and she made little embellishments on every single one of these. And then she's got like the flag things embellishments, and she just, oh, yeah. So she's made like those flag things that everybody was making with the charms, and she stuck them onto, um, sorry guys, I wasn't even in frame. She stuck them onto mylar pink heart acetate and made them shakers. That is so cute. I love them at all that and then she's even got more embellishments on the back look how cute oh my god what is this is this like another mylar thing it's like such a bright pink but i've never even seen that before is that vellum that's not vellum it's thicker than vellum how cute oh i love that so she did all that detail oh my goodness how pretty Thank you so much. And I really, really love this envelope. So I really want a tutorial. If you have one, let me know. Oh, it's this is not Mylar. This is, oh, it's like that vinyl. But I need to make one. I love this so much. This is so stinking cute. Let me know. You definitely made this. So you got to let me know how you made it. I mean, I guess it's simple, but I like tutorials. I like watching tutorials. If I wanted to, I could figure it out. But I also just like watching tutorials. <laughs> Here we have day 13. It says, I wish you happiness in this cute little bag. And look at this tag she made. Oh, this is like, um, she used one of those um, foam hearts, I think, that you could find at Michael's. And look at all the layering she did. That must be a die. That is a very cute die with the hearts. And then she layered another one and another one. And it says, sent with love and number 13. That is so cute. Look at this. All her packaging is so amazing. I feel like that's the one thing I struggle with. I definitely struggle with packaging and guys she just like packaged everything up oh my god even look at this she added little like um pom-poms to this how adorable gosh how cute is everything and then inside of here oh my god more goodies <gasps> are these from daiso <gasps> thank you so much these are look at these pom-poms these are from Daiso. What is this? Oh my gosh, they sell punches at Daiso. Look at this cute little ribbon punch. That is adorable. Oh my God, I love that. And it's the perfect size. I've been actually using one of my dies that, um, it's like a steel rule die that has, it's like a gingerbread house, but it has a teeny little ribbon and I keep using the ribbon, but my ribbon piece started sinking in because I've used it so much. So this is gonna come in so handy. And then she even sent me this. Look how pretty. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. Always need some shred. You guys know we always use lots of shred. <gasps> this cotton candy. Oh, this is oh, this is called wolf elk, but people have been using this for cotton candy. Or you could use it if you're making um cute little things with felt. You could put in like some wool or things like that. Oh my gosh. I need to learn and I need to figure out what to make with this. Oh, thank you. Oh my god, look, she sent me some zippers. <gasps> look how cute these are. These would be perfect for Easter, too. Look how cute. Oh my god, I've never been to a Daiso. So cute. These jammies. Oh my gosh. You spoiled me. I feel so spoiled, guys. Oh my gosh, Crystal. Everything looks amazing. And these jammies. Oh, more wool. Look at this. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. I gotta make some goodies. I don't know what yet, but I gotta make something. And then these little baggies, look how cute they are. It says peace, and there's like a little cell phone and a rainbow and a cassette tape. Such cute little baggies for um, Happy Mail. Even this one, oh, this says we are party people. 
And this one's got like a little um, closure here. And it's like a holographic iridescent pink kind of baggie. Those are so cute. Oh my gosh, I feel so spoiled. Look at this. I have a party gal and it's in a heart shape. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much. And these got a zipper too. These are so cute. I need to get to a Daiso. This says, thank you. Keep on smiling. Thanks for your mighty smile. It's a cute little like gift bag. Oh my gosh. And it's like foiled. Oh, so cute. I feel so spoiled. Thank you so much, Crystal. Oh my gosh. No wonder this box is so big. I'm truly spoiled. And then guys, last but not least, we got day 14. So she's got this tag that says, ooh la la. And you open this up. Look at all her ribbon and trims. I'm telling you guys, I'm literally keeping all of this ribbon and trim. This is going to go good with my albums or whatever it is that I'm making. I literally keep it all. So I'm going to keep that too. Cute little tag. And this is her number 14. I think I said that already. Keeping the bag because we always got to reuse those. And inside, actually, that would have to be really cute in a junk journal. I've been really into making junk journals, so, oh my god, she made me a stacked suitcase! Look how cute! Girl, you're going to have to tell me if you used um, printed paper or if you had the collection, because if this is all digital, I need to get myself that digital collection. Oh my god, but look at this, guys. Look at all that stitching she did all around, even on the chipboard. Oh my goodness. Look how cute everything is. She stitched all around this, including the bottom. Look at that, guys. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much for all the work you put into this. Everything's so cute. And inside of here, oh, look at these bees. Oh my gosh. They're little heart ones with um, the letters on it. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh. I literally feel so spoiled. So that's what she had in here. I've never even made one of these. I need to like really start making one. Oh, look at these beads she sent me. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much. So she's got these heart ones and these ones, the lips. Oh my gosh. And I love Valentine's Day beads. I love Valentine's Day. Thank you so much, girl. And this last one. Oh, look, more beads. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And what is this? Oh my gosh. Another sequin mix and a stamp. What is this? Oh my god, this is the cutest little thing ever. I have so many different sentiments on here. It says, thank you, happy birthday, sending love, congrats, celebrate. I'm sure you guys could read. Um, <laughs> so it says all of those and I have it here. Oh my goodness, thank you so much. And then she's got this beautiful sequin mix that she's made. Oh, I love this. Look how pretty. Girl, you spoiled me so much. I feel the love for sure. Oh my God, all the projects you created. So much inspiration. The tea, the um, hot air balloon, this thing. Um, the other thing that you made that had like the three memory decks cards in it. Oh my gosh, I need tutorials for it all. Please send all the tutorials, all the links. Just comment them down below or whatever you gotta do. I love it all. I just gotta find a place to display all this. But girl, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for putting in all this time all this crafting thank you for sending me all this inspiration oh my gosh so many ideas just from this and i hope you guys are watching this video i hope you guys are inspired i hope you guys create so many amazing things definitely check out all the other ladies that participated in the swap so you could check out their videos down below and see who's posting next and check out their channels thank you so much thank you rachel for having me be a part of the swap I just love it all. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I'll see you guys in my next crafty video. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.